Hello everyone, Digfig here, and welcome back to another The Outer Worlds video. We did find this guy's sports poster, so we're gonna go turn it into him, see what he has to say. On that poster yet? I keep wondering if it's come in. Um, give him the poster, here it is. Would you look at that? The Rizzo's logo is nice and bright, and you can still smell the ink on Mr. Holcomb's signature. I can't thank you enough. Still, you can have the bits I was gonna spend at the bar this week. You know what? Take my old toss ball blocker too. Never oh, get the chance to use it these days. I appreciate it, man. I hope you enjoy the poster. Uh, there's still this chick I need to talk to in here. That's the primary. Um. Uh. The cellar bay is dangerous. I don't want to get some of these side quests out of the way here. Let's see. Um, where is there's kids missing? Everyone in Cinema's house drive his travels. His mother thinks he'll be there. Um, oh, that's the one. Okay. Uh, I need to go do this one. I think this is the dead guy quest, to be honest. We can run over here. She needs this guy to come back on the shifts. Oh, yeah. Well, that's the dead guy's apartment, which I need to go to the bar. What you doing? You've really got to stop doing that. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm looking for Braxton. Braxton. I've never even heard of a Braxton. Got nothing for you. Sorry. You've never heard of a Braxton. Uh, you've been taking drugs. No. Okay. Maybe just a little. Braxton always has a good stash. And I just like to let loose a little. Stop thinking about the Marauders and the Raptodons outside, you know? No, I don't know. So you do know Braxton. Oh, oh damn. damn. Yeah, gotcha. He told me he was delivering to this house in the ruins south of town. Whole oh, family had fallen sick and he had some meds on hand. So maybe look for him there. That's all I need to know. Thank you. Yeah, we can both agree to that one, but you know, hopes and dreams, people, hopes and motherfucking dreams. Uh, where was that? bar place pretty sure it was sports bar sports bar if i was a sports bar where would i be that's the doctor's place that's the salt tuna place right here left field here to catch a game i'm afraid the transmission what can i do for you no i'm here i found this uh belting slip in a dead man's apartment Isaac, I was wondering why I hadn't seen him in a few days. I'd really like to help. Isaac was a sweet fellow, even if he did have terrible teeth. Okay. Um, cut to the chase. Do you know what happened or not? I'm listening. What do his teeth have to do with anything? Oh, we're right. gonna go number two. So the thing with Isaac is he didn't know where to stop. He'd get stuck on something, and he just couldn't let it go. Sometimes he'd drink purple berry punch by the leader. Other times he'd keep betting on a losing team. Started owing the wrong people money. So who did he owe? I don't know for sure, but I saw Elijah and his buddies pushing Isaac around. They're hooligans from Fallbrook. They sweep into town, drop supplies off behind the warehouse, and spend the rest of their stay getting rowdy over tossball games. They usually loiter in the alley behind the yacht club. They're not allowed in the bar anymore. I bet you anything Isaac ran into trouble with one of them. Thank you for the tip. Mr. Sanjar will be pleased to hear about it when you're done. I know he gets fed up with the Fallbrook bullies, but there's not much he can do. Okay, so they said behind the yacht club, and the yacht club is... Where is that one again? Still trying to memorize this town. The yacht club is here. Laws. 
Can a man enjoy the smooth menthol flavor of a stogie slim in peace? Um, you've got a brass for man doing absolutely what nothing, doing, sir. Is enjoying the moment. It's so rare that I can seize one apart from the jabbering masses of this wretched place. Okay. Um, your neighbors probably aren't missing your company either, come to think of it. Laws, what are you talking this about? Laws forgotten town. Cut off from the rest of the colony. Removed from any culture. I recall when Stellar Bay was a proper board affiliated town with regular shipments of Auntie Cleo's best and all the cereals. Before Sanjar took over MSI and got us all booted. Um, so you missed the good old days? Days of consumption and culture. When we weren't squabbling with the iconoclasts for lack of better things to do. Look, you're making me melancholy. Is there something you wanted? Leave you be really broad. I wonder sometimes what they're doing on other colonies. Um, uh -huh. think they're well, watching if I the were these guys, where would we be? Mm -hmm. You're not listening to a word, are you? Find the yacht club in the alley. Can't get behind the yacht club in the alley. Oh, yes, you can. Here, yeah. got thugs. Hey, what are you doing here? This is our secret alley. Oh, it's Burn so secretive. By those crates to market. Um, in that case, I should get going. Listen. That purple tooth said I know you killed. Up. Not that anyone has proof. And not that it's any of your business. Found your toss ball stick. This is gonna catch up with you, Eli. Um How? That was supposed to go out with the next batch of salt tuna. What are you suggesting, pal? Uh you bullied people long enough, you know what's good for you, you'll clear out and never come back. You're finished, leave Saltwater Bay before the people here run you out. Fine. This pissant town ain't worth it anyway. Okay. They're actually just gonna bug out of here with no... No fight, no doom. Me being a good guy and everything. Yeah. Well, we do have some points to spend here, and this should be all that was needed. To make it so can use their perks. And let's finish dumping the points into it, cause why not? I'll go in for a good cause there. Uh C V. Okay. So now we can actually use their abilities. Which is super useful. And F5, because I have an F5 in a long ass time. Um quest. What were we doing? We were doing the sacred people. We can go do that. No reason to stay in town all this time. We're gonna go for a little walk. Enjoy the peacefulness of the outside world in all its glory. Because, you know, there's nothing hostile out here at all. As far as I'm concerned, um, we are pushing into an area that I haven't been to. Sundays when we'd unload Saltuna shipments. Marauder, Marauder, Marauder. The is not to breathe through Marauder. And Marauder. So if I go stealth, I'm supposed to do more damage. Yeah. Oh, good juke on your part, buddy. Hey, you were just gonna run straight at me, but you weren't. Don't oh, shoot at me. I see you down there, look out. That random waviness or like sway. Sway is the word we're looking for. I went with waviness though. Um That was just super slow. Man, I'm getting old guys. Getting old. But either way, that's the sway makes me miss some of my shots. It's kind of embarrassing. But there's just huge lulls in combat in this game and like you get like a little bit rusty. You gotta get your ship back together. Also, I am totally not in my try-hard position. My aim, I would, my whole gameplay ability drops, I would say, probably close to 30% when I sit back like this. Rather than sitting up. 
I don't know why exactly. It's kind of random. I'm sure there's some reason behind it. It's probably to do with the way my arm can move and stuff, plus my visual distance from the monitor is farther than usual. Don't want to go up there. Oh, what was I doing? I'm checking this house. Race 60 house, get back in the whole loot clear and open world. This house has a hole blown in it, so we can get in here. That is looted. It is not looted. Boop. Boop. Oh, I did the boop and I didn't pick it up. Embarrassing being so bad, guys. My bad. Sometimes you can even fuck up looting. Um... Sure, I'll take all your stuff. Because, you know, I'm, I'm a professional looter. Um, not the best professional looter, but a professional looter nonetheless. As you guys can see here, I do miss half the stuff. Um. Ah, there's an upstairs to this. Super freaking windy here, man. Those clouds are moving like 100 miles an hour plus up there. That's ridiculous. Absolutely howling winds. Take everything out of the fridge. Helmets, yeah, I'll take all your stuff. You did. At least you died in bed. Looks like you didn't even see it coming based on how you're all huddled up and stuff. It's possible you died from like sickness or exposure, which is not a pleasant death. But either way, it doesn't look like you had that hard of a death. You're even cuddled in there with a little stuffed animal I'm gonna go with. Don't know if it's actually a stuffed animal or an actual sprat. Kinda looks like an actual sprat. Either way, you cuddled in with a sprat and you died. You weren't alone 100%. I, would like to die uh, I think all of these guys would. If I were to take a guess. Ooh, got a mega. You did. Oh, I do have the companion abilities. I should actually, you know, use those since I spent all the points to unlock them. Oh, 360 this building. See some marauders in that direction. Need to watch my fire. If we're shooting in that direction at all. Mm, got a little church here. Marauders seem to have made their house. Um, I bet you got something to say about this. Isn't this one of your like clergy areas or whatever you're gonna call them? Didn't you feel weird that it's abandoned? Huge missed dialogue, dialogue opportunity if he doesn't have anything to say about being in here. That's for damn sure. Seems like it is just a massively missed. Up a nice hat. The skeletons in this game are like oddly disproportionate. I feel. It just doesn't look right and I don't know why. But a nice hat. What does a nice hat do? Persuade plus seven. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Not too shabby actually. Um, I guess we're gonna bug out of here. It's what's his name has no passive dialogue about this place being turned into something other than a house of worship. I still find odd. Um, three sixty. This building will reveal nothing whatsoever. <laughs> We made this player waste a little bit extra time, which in Keese's playtime, that's a cool little circle thing. Um, I know it's not actually what they thought, but it's kind of funny. Heard it. The tamed one. Means we're looking at NPCs. Get out of here. Oh, you almost made it to me. Good shot, good try. That's the last of Got him! Dick are actually doing some work with that light assault rifle. 
I don't like that he has that. He seems to be able to put way more fire down range than with the heavies just because of the reload times and stuff. I should stop canceling my reload like a hundred times in a row. As usual, 360 of a building. Nothing. Nothingness. Always nothingness. Put across and do the next one. 360. Ooh, there's a hole in this one. Um. Interesting dead space in a house. The doors that go to it. Interesting. Valley, valley, interesting. Can't go in there either. What is up here? Hello. Think we got him? Wasn't dealing with that at all. They were way too close for me to want to use this uh, nine rounder. I panicked a little and I was like, fuck it, busting out the big guns. Dr. Williams is dead and I picked up some sort of something off of him. Um, a quest item. Dispensary supply room. Uh, okay. Pretty sure I already hacked that door open, so it's kind of irrelevant. But it is nice to know that they put like the keys out here and everything where you would be able to get in there no matter what. Even if you cannot hack them. Different wires of acquiring said keys. I think I already did a 360 this building, but we're just going to do one more. Make sure that's where the actual family is, so we will... Hold off on going in there and do a 360 of this one. Sell that loot. Transition into the residence. Why are these people living out here outside the wall? Surrounded by marauders and shit. A visitor? What an unexpected surprise. Please come in. Come in. I, for one, welcome a reprieve from our travels. That is, if you'll have us, kind sir. Oh. That's the spirit. Now come in. Make yourselves comfortable. That's giving me a creepy vibe. Um. I'm afraid we don't get many visitors out here. The raptodons and marauders scare off all but the boldest. And if you've braved them, you must be exhausted. Why don't you stay for dinner? Uh... Oh, number one I'm sure I would remember something like that now quit fretting yourself about that make yourself at home dinner's almost ready oh that was a hundred percent fat fingered oh my bad my bad um good because that was 100% fat finger mouse click. Whoops. Sometimes you just negligent discharge right into someone's face. That's why you should never just walk around with your finger on the trigger. Oh, I didn't quick save for quite a while either. Um, seems to be right out front here. So we're going to put the gun away. Definitely just, just going to put that away. And we're going to swap to the assault rifle. Because I... This guy's still giving me the creeps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm looking for a man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure you haven't seen him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. You must be famished. So are we, my friend. Why is the door locked? Is it sticking again? I'm afraid nothing out here works the way it used. There's a bit of a trick to jimmying it open. I'll see to it once we've finished dinner. Yeah, this this is creepy. I do appreciate your patience. I um This is what we call really fishy. Oh, hello there. You come for for a uh, dinner? They're going to try and eat me. Um 
Sorry, I'm not real good with uh, names. Is something wrong? It just gets hard to remember things. I recall moments, feelings, but the details slip. Did they eat the doctor? I felt like that after my dad passed. Walked around in a haze for weeks. I'm sorry you're feeling that way too. Other times it's like there's fog. I. Sorry, have we talked about this before? Maybe I can help you. That's nice of you. I usually feel better after I eat. Mama said dinner's almost ready, huh? Um, I'm gonna leave you alone for now. <sighs> They're gonna try and eat me. But like, you got a UDL heavy armor here. You got this dude in freaking rapid heavy armor. Me in armor, like, you don't look like pushovers. Rise. And just when I was beginning to fear we'd seen the last of good company for a spell. Yet the eternal provides, does it not? Only if you give yourself over to the plan, Martha. Uh, may I call you Martha? By all means, just make yourself comfortable. Company is always a reason for cheer. Mm. Uh, two. The if you're eternal eager. does not desire that we huddle and hide, crowded in by walls. We all share the spark of the divine, and we were made to spread it across the stars. Okay. Out here, we are free. And even apart from society, the universe provides for us, as your being here proves. What do you mean by that? They're going to eat me. Um, things have a way of working out, that I guess. they do. Though it's up to us to make the most of those opportunities, wouldn't you say? Look at me, prattling on as if this gravy is going to cook itself. Why don't you run along until we are ready for dinner? That's everyone talked to. Um, requires a math or house key to unlock. What do they want me to do upstairs? So. Uh -oh. I have a way out now. That's good news. I'm not gonna fully commit to. This the whole red room thing. I've seen that movie. Don't feel safe. Oh, hi there. You look Did sick you as a dog. Rocket candies? What are you talking about? You know, the ones that come in a bottle with a rocket ship on the front. They don't taste very good, but they make me feel so nice. Too much drugs. That's too bad. There was this other man who used to bring them. Not anymore, though. What's his name, Braxton? I don't know. I'm not really supposed to talk to strangers. So gonna eat me. Um, what can you tell me about this man? Mama and Papa said he came from the city. When we got sick one time, he brought those candies to make us well again. And they worked. Now we feel better than ever. Mama says they're a gift from the Eternal. One way to put it. Why isn't he bringing the more? making us sick. Mom and Papa got real mad at him for that. They went to have a talk with him. Afterwards, they said he wasn't coming back again. They killed him. Okay. Maybe I'll see you at dinner. We wouldn't want to intrude. Still gonna eat me. They're still gonna eat me. Yep, that's a murder room. That is just straight up a murder room. Murder room with a hole busted in the wall. Very, very, very sketchy there. We're gonna go into the red room because I want that chest. I do see the murder room upstairs.
This doesn't get me killed by coming in here. Dead assault rifle. I want the upgraded version of that, damn it. Salmon. Sunrise, tree, sky, hover. Random poems, okay. Oh, I guess we're gonna go. Oh, I'm gonna go outside first. F5, save it here. This is purely just a way out. But I kind of want to see this through. So we're going to go up into the murder room now. Just making sure there was nothing out there. She's gone. That's concerning. Um... No, 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 no. It is unnatural. An affront to the grand plan. Yeah, I think. I need to remember supervised Ram. If lost, please return to Bellarvam, supervise an MSI fishery operations. Okay. And pick up supper time. That is the name of this freaking weapon. Don't play with your food. Um Escape the house. Okay. So let's go downstairs. So we're pulling our gun out now, cause. Yeah, she's still going to try and eat me. But what's this? You're tracking blood into the kitchen. Oh dear. You've been nosy, haven't you? Yes, I have been. Uh, yeah, it's one of my better qualities. Uh, murdering cannibal accused me of being nosy. <laughs> oh, lols. Um, it's one of my better qualities. How very rude. Time to teach you some manners. I don't really want to throw down. I can do it. I can throw down. Oh, how'd that feel, madame? You were seem to be ragdolled on the end of her hammer. Yeah, they all did. Well, I personally am happy that they are no longer a threat to this town. There was another option of going out the door and not to murdering them. I don't even know if that's murdered. I think it was our intent was to go down there and kill them when it wasn't through a court of law or anything like that. Whatever. By the way, guys, we're out of time for this episode. And uh, we brought justice to all those people that those people ate. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, check out some of these other videos appearing on my screen here shortly. Um, and if you like some of those, think about liking, subscribing, commenting, hitting the notification bell, watching all my content front to back to really help my analytics, and being an awesome member of the community, guys. And I will see you in the next video. Dig big out. Ah, what do we got here? A human corpse. Let me just saw off this arm real quick. Yeah, um, nom, 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 n